a better than expected jobs report today from the Labor Department, which showed the U.S. economy added a whopping 517,000 jobs last month. The unemployment rate dipped to 3.4 percent. ABC News chief business correspondent Rebecca Jarvis helps us unpack these numbers. So, Rebecca, talk about a surprise here. We were expecting, what, about 200,000 jobs or less to be added, and now we've got this number of over 500,000, the unemployment rate dipping just a little bit. What does this tell you about the state of the job market and the economy right now? Uh, well, Alexis, it's not the balloon story, but it is certainly a blowout for the jobs market. And really what it tells you is that all of the fear around recession and what hiking interest rates, which the Fed has now done eight times in a row, what that would do to the economy, it has not materialized as far as the jobs market is concerned. Those 517,000 jobs added in the month of January, strongest job creation since February of 2021. And remember, back in February of 2021, we were trying to recover the jobs that had been lost in the early days of the pandemic. So you were seeing these gigantic jobs reports. Another factor here, though, is obviously inflation. And that's going to be the key question that the Fed is asking themselves as we go into the next Fed meeting, which is next month, and as well as the next CPI report, the next inflation report, which is on Valentine's Day. Uh, Alexis, when you look at the fact that American families right now are still paying about $371 more a month, especially especially when you look at food at the grocery store. It's up 10.5% from a year ago. The Fed very likely will see today's jobs report as an indicator that they can keep hiking interest rates in order to bring that inflation down. Um, and I would add one other point to this, Alexis, and that is that we've seen all of these headlines recently about major tech companies laying people off. Well, when you look at this report, that is not having an impact, and people who are being laid off are very, very quickly finding work again in their are still these two job openings for every job seeker. Yeah, Alexis. the job market just seems to be defying reason, Rebecca. So I'm curious if you had a yeah. chance to dig in and see where maybe a lot of the jobs are being added or where are we seeing layoffs? Well, where you're seeing a lot of it is leisure and hospitality. There are some government jobs. There's retail jobs. There's really very widespread strength. Some of the areas, like some of the, the very specific tech areas, you have seen some moderate weakness there. But overall, it's strength. And it's stronger when you look back at November and December. Those months were also upgraded more jobs than were anticipated. Alexis? Maybe we can achieve that soft landing the Fed keeps talking about after all. Rebecca yes. Jarvis. Thanks so much. Yeah. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.